What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to a new video of a familiar product. Boom. 2018 Panini Select Football first off the line. Just, this stuff has been amazing. Not just to me, but to pretty much everybody. I've pulled some really amazing stuff in my first two boxes. Baker, RPA right there. You got that to focus. Um, Brady, which that one's actually sold. Uh, the person who I sold it to will be getting it shipped soon. Just waiting for some stuff to clear and it'll be all his. So that one's sold. Baker, I'm keeping. Um, pulled a Saquon RPA, uh, Orange Pulsar. I pulled uh, Philip Lindsay Zebra, the one for big bucks, and uh, a Far of Gold. Tons of tons of great stuff, and I'm absolutely pumped. I saw someone pull a Aaron Rodgers one of one auto. I saw, um, let's see, what else? I saw some other case hits. Just crazy stuff. Huge RPAs. Another Baker. Just big, big, big time pulls. And I'm really excited to get into this last box. To be honest, my expectations very low. These don't come in case format, so we could have anything in here, to be honest. And we're going to rip this open right after we show the 12 packs, 5 cards per pack, 2 autos, 1 mem. You can't get XRCs. Don't know the rarity on those. First off the line. And Zebras. Who might, wouldn't mind getting another one of those. Rookie. Uh, there's the back end. Yeah, cool. So I've never really hit an auto XRC. That'd be pretty cool. Well, let's get into it now. Waste no more time. I love Select. I didn't get any regular select, but now that I'm thinking about it, maybe I should have. I uh, had three first off the line boxes, and I'm just trying to, you know, save some money for other stuff. So I didn't want to just go completely ham into select. That being said, I already pulled, you know, some of the best cards, so it's not like. I mean, it can obviously get better, but I don't want to keep pushing my luck. All right. So, that being said. Take the top off, Mr. Watson, bringing us some good luck, and let's get into these Packeronis. Ooh, I love Select. Yes, yes, yes. All right, uh, let's start. Let's start at the front, yeah, why not? So once again, with first off the line, you get it 24 to 48, at least uh, 24 to 48 hours. Before the release date, you get it at the SRP, so $120, and you also get um, one Orange Rookie RPA, Orange Pulsar, Neon Orange, that is, number 223, as well as a uh, Neon Orange Parallel number to 9, Base Parallel. I like that Brady, for example. So tons of great stuff to look for. I love when the first off the line just guarantees a nice color parallel because kind of extra stuff to be looking for. And right off the bat, I don't know if that was a Pulsar or not. All right, David Johnson. I always feel bad peeking, but... I can't help myself. There's the uh, the base the base base one concourse, and you walk away with very few base cards in the end. But yeah, um, Dallas Goddard rookie card, Troy Aikman. You have a uh, Jason Sanders. What's interesting is with Prison Basketball, a lot of times you'll see print lines on here. I don't. I never see too many print lines on football. <gasps> Ooh, one ninety nine of one ninety nine. That's something special. And here's Le'Veon Bell. You get two of these per box. This is the field level. That's what we got the Lindsay of. Those are the rarest. So I will put that there. All right. Now that we've gone slow through that first pack, we can kind of pick up the pace a bit. This one feels thick. I might save the RPA for last this time. But we'll see. Chase Edmonds rookie card. All right. Carson Wentz. Ryan Tannehill, I believe he's a uh, gonna be playing for a new team. Jimmy Garoppolo, number thirteen of ninety nine. What number is he? Ten. Oh, all right. Brandon Cooks field level and Anthony Miller field level. So got quite a few of these already, and nice to get a rookie one. Another thin pack. Now football select I like a lot. I've never been a fan of. Um, basketball select, which I should have soon. And I have three boxes of that first off the line, so we'll see what happens with that. But I'm not a big fan of basketball select in, in past years. We'll see what happens. It's two autos or mem cards, which I'm not a big fan of. Um, I mean, three autos or mem. So you can get you know, two mems, which really stinks. Considering the price, Jordan Howard, uh, or uh, what's it called? Hollow, Prism, Silver, whatever you want to call it. Field level. Sony Michelle, Phenomenons, and Shaquem Griffin. All right. Then I believe this week we have 
I, I'm going to try to get Heritage Baseball. You'll see how it works out. I will be at school at the time, so if I can quickly, between class, go grab a box, I will. If not, I, I'll probably have it sometime later. And also we have, ooh, what's that? Oh, no, never mind. It's one of those inserts. Philip Lindsay rookie card. We'll also have Contenders Optic, which I'm a big fan of. Jimmy G, Odell, Field Lobel, Prism, Alvin Kamara, Sensations, and Derek Carr. This is the uh, premier level, the one I haven't shown the back of yet. All right. Nothing crazy yet. This, hmm. Let's open it. This one feels weird. Is it just a filler? No, it's a hit. All right. It's, if we do have a hit in here. I think it's just a mem card. So I have no problem doing that now. Zeke. Darnold. Todd Gurley. Prism. And that is the uh, premier level. Number eight. Is that uh, Lamar? Yes, yeah, Lamar. <laughs> is that bad that I know that? All right. Uh, it's Leonard Fournette, and just a base jersey of Lamar Jackson. Let's get a sleeve for that. So, uh, so far this year, now there are a few products left. I think Case, Contenders Optic, and maybe one other. At least that would get. Um, I've never hit Lamar Auto, or a Darnold, or an Allen. But I've hit a Baker, and I've hit a bunch of Rosens. Alright, keep going. Looking for that Pulsar, maybe this pack? No, but we have something red and really shiny. Ronnie Harrison, Saquon, Josh Allen, Prism, and this is a red parallel coming up. Josh Allen, um, this is the Concourse, and Brian Dawkins, number two, 49. I like this pattern a lot, the little X Factor. Checkerboard, whatever you want to call it. Different names for different sports. I call it Phil X. Very nice. Weapon X. And James Conner. I'm recording this pretty late, so I don't want to scream. If I pull anything loud, I won't scream. I'll just get quietly excited when you hear that, that oh my gosh, no way. Sometimes I record way too late. And I think we have a, a bronze? I didn't know that was a parallel. Or copper? I know it was last year, but Denzel Ward, Von Miller, and Calvin Ridley. That's pretty cool. Number 275. 46 to 75, and that's the field level. It's a neat looking card. I like that. And Mariota. One thing I don't like about Chrome cards is they slide all over the place. So you place it down and it starts spinning. So far, solid box. We've only hit one of our hits though, so. And we don't have a hit here, so. Uh, Brennan Scarlett. Miles Garrett. I always say it, but big fan of him. James Washington. And Jerry Rice. That's a cool looking card. The red just. The red and gold looks great. That looks really good. Number two, 199. 137 of 199. And Gurley. How many packs do we have left? I feel like we haven't. Here's a thick one. Here's a thick one. Here's a thin one. And this should be the last thick one. All right. So we're just going to free up some space on this desk. This should be our pulsar here, I believe. Or auto. I'm not sure. Up. Should be our pulsar, right? Maybe not. We have an autograph here, though, but we should... Hmm. All right, we'll see. Andrew Luck, Josh Rosen, and uh, uh, Dante Hall. Not very familiar with him, but red numbered to 25. I thought 25 was, um, was the tie-dye ones, but I guess maybe if he signs less, then the print runs all go down together. Interesting, Dante Hall. If you're a Chiefs fan, let me know if he was good or not. I don't know my legends or older players like that. And we have Miles Garrett and Clay's Campbell. You know what I just realized? I feel like I've been doing this a lot with our select breaks. You know, just brain farting. We can easily have the orange pulsar with the filler. So, um, 
Hmm. Which one feel like the RPA? We'll go like this. Oh, here's our orange pulsar right here. Jesse Bates. Actually, we'll go like this. We'll pull from the back. Aikman. Khalil Mack attack. Snapshots. These are really nice. And Khalil Mack is my fave. Here's our friend Filler. Actually, yeah, actually, yeah. I was going to use him to reveal, but we already had the Jesse Bates to reveal him. Mahomes. And Texans. Watson would be cool. Hey, Watson, there you go. Oh, woo, jersey number, four of nine. Let's go. Four of nine. For those of you who are watching the video where I pulled the Baker, that's also jersey numbered. Some of you guys, I can tell, clicked right off the video once I pulled it because after that, like uh, maybe 30 seconds later, I said that it was jersey numbered. I got like 20 comments. People like, God, you missed it. You missed it. But um, I did see it after for those of you who clicked off. Deshaun Watson, that's a very nice, super short print. So which one feels like the RPA? Go with this one first. This one's RPA. We'll do this one first. Change your plans. I could go for a nice one of one in here though. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. I don't think so. Andy Dalton. Russell Wilson. Baker Mayfield, Concourse and Oh, never mind. I thought that was super off centered. Concourse uh Prism. That's a nice one. Love Baker. Put that here. I saw some random rumor that Russell Wilson wanted to go to the um, the Giants, and that just sounds so far-fetched. I would never see why he'd leave the Seahawks. He has control there. And uh, round one, pick four, Denzel Ward. Love that card. Love those draft cards and Steven Jackson. So here is our RPA. So far, it's just been a an okay box. Nothing crazy, but, you know, I'll take it. So let's see who we have. We have Derek Carr. Once again, our expectations aren't too high, so I won't be bummed out if we don't hit anything huge. Uh, Baker, a, hey, I think we can rule out Baker from the RPA. Oh, that's nice. Oh, what's that numbered? Oh, it's not numbered at all. <laughs> uh, Hayden Hurst, round one, pick 25. We'll draft one. And let's see who our RPA is. Oh, it's probably upside down. Definitely don't want to drop it, which I've been known to do. Uh, number Edo Smith. <laughs> All right, a little off sticker, but that's a nice, nice patch right there. Edo, and he actually isn't that bad. I watched, uh, I didn't watch, but I was paying attention to some Falcons games this year because I had Matt Ryan. And um, when Freeman and Coleman were out at different times, he did okay. You know, I'm gonna do. I don't want to damage the card. So, for those of you who don't, aren't familiar with that, I do this. I don't know if I cut it deep enough, but let's see. Usually, once you do that, it slides in. Don't want to damage the corners. Let's see, now that corner looks pretty good. So, 14 to 20, what number is he? Oh, 25. Edo <laughs> Smith. All right, there you go. So, there is our box uh, overall. Select was great for me this year. I don't plan on having another hobby box unless I just walk into my LCS and it's at the MSRP um, or SRP. And um, yeah, maybe I'll have some singles in like the boom box or something like that or one of those sub boxes. But yes, yeah, so we have Edo Smith. We have uh, Hurt, Hurt and Hurst, Denzel Ward, up oh, Sean Watson. Here we go. Cleo Mack, Dante Hall, Jerry Rice. Oh, this nice Calvin Ridley. I forgot about that. Omar Jackson. And yeah. So um, I think my favorite card will be the RPA. It looks nice. Put that down carefully. And there we go. So overall, select. Big thumbs up this year. Did very well. I like the way the cards look. I'm still waiting on that Saquon RPA redemption. So hopefully it comes soon. And it looks nice. And uh, that's going to do it. So man, do I love select. Can't wait for it next year. Maybe I'll surprise you guys and have another box. Who knows? But as of now, it's going to be the end of select for me. Great stuff. Definitely recommend getting a box. Uh, prices probably have gone up. I haven't been paying attention to those prices, but overall, very satisfied. So let me know what you guys pulled from your boxes. What do you think of Select out of 15 through this year's, uh, not 15, 16, 17, 18, those three years, which years Select do you like the most? Because I like Select all three years. I think, 
it's tough. I think 17, mm -hmm. 16 is definitely the last period, but I really like select. So yeah, let me know. Interesting question. So thanks for watching, taking up 15 minutes of your day and uh, stay tuned for more videos this week. Should have, um, once again, Heritage, if I can, possibly. That would be on Wednesday or Thursday or Friday, who knows. And then Friday, hopefully, Contenders Optic, I think. I think I got pushed back. And also, uh, maybe I'll post like, another Prison Break, or my last one of my last ones of those ones. And um, yeah, that's it. So thanks for watching, guys. Please like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later.